What is dark motivation? Dark motivation is a type of drive that stems from a strong desire to finish activities and advance personally in any way. It is brought on by a variety of negative, strong emotions. Humans frequently experience feelings of envy, insecurity, and the impulse to compare. Even while it's wise to let go of those emotions, they occasionally serve as an invaluable resource. I had the urge to advance after seeing that post. Because seeing that girl with another boy made me feel bad, my subconscious wanted me to feel good. And one of the best things I can do to feel good is to work on myself. Dark motivation may be a very effective tool for encouraging you to push over your comfort zone and work hard to achieve your goals. I was forced to leave that environment by acting since it hurt to just sit at home and do nothing. Even if I ultimately slept too little. Examples of dark motivation. Almost any bad emotion might be the root of dark motivation. These feelings include any of the following. Envy, insecurity, anxiety, discomfort, etc. You'll probably feel inspired to exercise if you see someone you despise in amazing form. When you lose your job, You'll be inspired to look for one that pays well and develop in your profession. Or perhaps a breakup has inspired you to work on your social abilities. Negative feelings are the only source of dark motivation. Some might even describe them as immature and childish. Although they come naturally to us, you can definitely benefit from using them. See, a part of your psyche wants to exact revenge on your supervisor and make them regret their choice when you advance in your profession after being dismissed. A portion of your mind wants to prove to your ex that you're better off without them by making them jealous when you date following a breakup. These types of motivation are typically stronger than motivation in everyday circumstances. A drive to move toward pleasure is far weaker than a desire to move away from pain. How to use dark motivation to your advantage. These emotions can boost your motivation like a powerful addition to your exercise regimen. It will be really helpful, but if you use it excessively, it could be hazardous. You see, your mental health will probably suffer if you constantly compare yourself to others and allow jealousy and insecurity to rule your life. I suggest you do this. Keep in mind that there is no need to compare yourself to others and that accomplishments do not make one a better person. You don't need to prove yourself to anyone in order to have genuine confidence. Dark motivation can be really helpful, though if you employ it sometimes. Try adding some dark motivation when you know you should do something, but don't feel like it to see how you feel. The next time you know you should exercise or finish a chore, Give it some serious thought. Check to see if you have any feelings of jealousy or insecurity that might inspire you. And after finishing the task, let it go. Although it may initially be uncomfortable, nothing worthwhile in life comes easily. Why not take advantage of the insecurities and underlying feelings that we all harbor as dark motivation? Learn to manage them so that you can expose them when necessary but that they don't interfere with your daily life. This is the most effective technique to make use of dark motivation. This served as my primer on sinister motivation. You may be familiar with this phenomenon under a different name, but the underlying ideas are the same. You can transform your unfavorable feelings into spurts of motivation with some practice and eventually learn to be grateful for having them. But use dark motivation with care. I assume that you desire overall happiness. Apply it in a way that doesn't detract from the quality of your life as a whole but is just sufficient to keep you constantly bettering yourself. 